we found that um, uh, Google Plus now does uh, the circles in alphabetical order. And before, it was done like with no rhyme or reason, kind of just all over the place, and you couldn't really organize the things the way you wanted them to be. So now, uh, the, the way to do things is, is uh, to do them alphabet. Uh, I'm sorry, numerically, because it's much easier to do them numerically than alphabetically because you have no control over alphabet, but you do have a control over numbers. I'm going to show you how it works here instead of just rambling on here. So check this out. So basically what you do is you go to a new circle and we're going to num number this one 0, 05 and we're going to call it test 1. And then we're going to hit create a, a circle. As you can see it goes to 0, 0, 005 um, and it goes it positions itself there. We can do another test and we can say we're going to name this um, 0, 0 and we're going to name it test 2. We're going to put it, and it's going to go in front of the one. So it goes there. You see how that works? See how zeros become go before the one, zeros? Now, if we wanted to try to 100, now watch what happens if we go 100. And this will, you'll understand why um, I did it this way in the first place. So test three. And see where it positions itself? It positions itself right here. So basically, now you understand how the whole circle numbering scheme works. Hope this was a good tutorial for you guys in my first audio. All right, take it easy.